Toaster Let Toasters! Hello and welcome back, Battlestar Galactica fans. This is Takehitsu, and you are the Take family. Alrighty, so we got one turn, we gotta do this mission, Helios Alpha. Let's see here, what do we got going? Okay, we got a bunch of the battle stars built up, the big ones. The Virgon Guardians, they look like they're ready. Um, we got the Scorpion Stingers over here. They are also ready. Well, they got 160 Tillium. Uh, the Pike on Pikes are pretty much good. So we got to go... Okay, so looking at this, we've got Pycon and Geminon that need to be saved. Toron needs to be saved. Uh, Capricorn Crusaders, they're too small. They need to get built up a little bit more. So let's go ahead and do this. We're gonna send. We're gonna leave the Scorpion Stingers there for a minute. We're gonna send the Pycon Pikes over to Toron. We will send the Virgon Guardians over to Pycon. Cost me ten tillium. Not a big deal. The Aquarian Aces. They're not ready yet. They need some more tillium. Uh, they also need a adamant, it looks like. Let's just go over here. we got two carriers coming in. We need to build up an adamant frigate. Boom. Is that two or one? Why did it put on two? Well, whatever. I'll just leave it for the moment. Um, I think that's about it. Let's see what happens. Boom. 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 Okay, so here we got a battle. This will be an extremely easy one. This is to save uh, Pycon. I will do that and get back to you in just a second. Alrighty, so that battle was pretty easy. We're about to jump right in here to do the media stunt over Helios Alpha. From what we've seen previously, these, vic these uh, side missions are getting a little bit more complicated as we go. So let's see what we got going on here. Alrighty, we are all set up, and here we go. Prepare to jump in three, two, one. The stream is still up and broadcasting. You've got the twelve colonies watching, Commander. I've only done this like a hundred times, I already know. Okay, thank you. Okay, so there's a bunch of mines. That's always uh, good to know. Let's get this going this way. Alrighty, time to get going. We got to move in a little bit. Not significantly. Actually, we don't, might not have to move in at all. Um, as long as this guy can get far enough away to be okay. Let's see about moving like this, just sticking to formation. Bamsis, Wamsis, Katamsis. All right. So far, so good. Let's see what we got going on. All right. Let's launch everything. Cross the board. Um. Oh, you're there, 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 there. Let's see what we got going on here this time. That's interesting. They have not launched a single fighter type, so we're going to go in here and scout them. Yes, sir. And hopefully just wreck them all because that should be extremely easy. Okay. Let's see here. We're going to send you after this one. Understood. And then we're going to send a swarm after that one right there. You're already targeted. So the entire swarm is going to go after the second one. Aside from the scouters. They're scouting and then we'll be good. I'm a little surprised that they don't have any raiders. But, you know. Yes, I do know that um, in the future what's most likely going to happen is they're going to have a group jump in after us. Alright, so let's just make sure that the fleet's still moving in a solidized so say we 
formation kind of manner. There we go. Boom. They're not moving all that fast either. I'm kind of curious as to what we're dealing with. A bunch of revenants, maybe? Um, some serastas? I don't know. So, alright, so we're going to move you here. Okay. Slower round. Yes, We're going to get this guy around behind us so that he's out of danger's way. Okay, we got missiles incoming. There is a revenant. Multiple revenants and some nemesis. Okay. So with incoming arse face um, firing power, we're going to stick two flat cannons up on the left side. Not that that's uh, surprising to anybody. Alright, so let's move like this. Still trying to figure out what their initial plan is. So they launch torpedoes. We'll knock them out with this round of flak. Then we're going to, I guess we could nuke these two guys. Um, where's my scouting parties? Okay, you're already scouted, so I want you to move on to scout the next one, right there. Understood. You're targeting that one, you're targeting that one. Okay, so that would be all of our scouting is done. You guys aren't close enough to launch your missiles yet, so we're just going to go without it. Um, boom, flak fields are up. Like two torpedoes got through, I think. Not very much. Okay, so they have a Hydra. We now see their entire fleet. So, I'm going to send the entire swarm after the Hydra. Might as well. Actually, no. Let's just start picking off these little nemesis bastards. Understood. Okay. Uh, nemesis number one is being targeted by the swarm. You guys can go ahead and launch. We'll go ahead and do that after that guy. Do 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 Bunch of uh, missiles launching. Bun do 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 do. And there's a nemesis who's going to die. Oh, I didn't launch you yet. Okay, you're supposed to be targeting this one. There we go. All right. With the size of our swarm, these nemesis are just like sitting ducks, really. Alright, so that's good. Let's keep getting you to move further forward. Let's go ahead and put everybody into attack position for the moment. Uh, da da do 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 And then let's go ahead and drop the two flak fields for one round. We're going to go ahead and we'll just launch everything we got right now. Might as well. I don't see any reason why not. I'm going to canter this guy a little bit. On it, Commander. Okay, you are going to launch your nuke. Might as well at the first one. You're going to launch your nuke at the one in the back. Right there. Then these three will launch all they got after this one in the front. And that's pretty much a guaranteed that on once these way. revenants get anywhere near us, they're dead. So, yeah, that, that does that. And then let's see here. You. You. Those nemesis are going to be launching torpedoes again this turn. Uh, there's a... Most likely what's going to happen is that those torpedoes are going to hit. But... They might still be far enough away where we're good. Yep, nemesis are launching missiles just like I said they would. One nemesis is already dead. And their missiles did not get here yet, so we're good. Alright, let's see how long we got till these guys get away. 
And it just says defend them, so probably not a set time zone. All right, so we're going to stick up the flak fields again. Okay, there you go. Let's move a little bit more like this and like this. We're going to get back into setup formation just like that. Very easy battle, guys. I apologize. I didn't know this was going to be that easy, or I probably would have skipped it. But, you know, it is what it is. That revenant's going to die. That revenant's going to die. That one didn't even need the nuke. That's kind of disappointing. We are, Oh, we killed... All the, nem the revenants are dead. So, let's go ahead and have the swarm go after the hydra just to make sure we don't have to deal with that too much do 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 yes sir i'm not going to tell my guys other my main fleet yes, what to attack because there's only a couple nemesis one and army. each one of my ships can solo a nemesis without even really having an issue so this battle's pretty much wrapped up just like that easy smash and grab we're going to get a lot of resources and stuff for this requisition points and all that good stuff and we can uh, make some bigger commanders and go from there yeah very nice easy missions are always nice right guys yes sir all right let's see here yes, yes sir may not be telling them who to attack but i'm still going to tell them where to go there we go that nemesis got too close. That one's getting shot at as well. So is that one. Only one remaining. And the Hydra's remaining as well. But we're about to bomb you, so you're going to die faster as well. Alright, since there's only one of them remaining, we're going to actually rotate our fleet to focus fire on him. We don't need to tell them to. It would give a slight damage bo bonus, but... He's he's a toaster. He's done for. Yep, dead. There goes the Hydra getting bombed. Bamsis, easy money. You guys can cancel your flak fields so you don't actually flak each other or the returning vipers and swarm. All right, you guys going to head here. And boom. Gonna watch the vipers and stuff kill you. Very easy, guys. It was a easy and well done mission. Hostile marks are down. And our ratings are up. Good job, Commander. Alrighty, guys. Well, that was an easy battle. Thank you for tuning in for that. Um, metaphorically speaking. I mean, that's what they were doing in the show I mean the game so whatever anyways um <clears throat> so here we are set up with pretty much everything um next maybe one turn two the Aquarian Aces will jump in let's go ahead and end our turn once see if we get something going on for today we that that's simple I can just auto resolve that one um so we don't Next episode, we will see what happens. I will talk to you guys then. I hope you have a wonderful evening and good night. Time to make a bunch of mama toasters cry. Set condition one. I repeat, set condition one. This is not a drill.
Never stood a chance. We have one on the sea. Valley on me. Thank you.